Elliot Loney, welcome to Terrible TV, mate. Sorry. Uh, does that tractor? No, nah, don't worry about okay. the sounds. Oh, fine. No worries. Sorry, guys. Yeah. Elliot Loney, <laughs> welcome to Terrible TV, <laughs> mate. Oh, man, how are you? Yeah, I was good. Today, yeah. Elliot, I've got a very special treat for you. I yep. know you're going to love this. Yep. So we are watching a reality show. Awesome. About a man who is addicted to dating older women, but not MILFs, GILFs, seniors, like 70 plus. See, that's just weird, man. But, you know, someone's going to fuck the grandmas. <laughs> right? A lot of them are missing their husbands. They've been well, gone for 10 years. <laughs> you know, whip out the Vaseline and get rooting. My name's Kyle. I'm 31. I live in Pittsburgh. And I'm addicted to dating older women. <laughs> you didn't even need to tell me that this guy was interested in fucking grandmas. <laughs> I got that purely from the moment he said his name was Kyle. <laughs> Hey guys, my name's Kyle, and I, I punch walls, and I also punch old box. <laughs> Much older women. Like 60, 70, 80 year old older women. 80? 80 years old, man. 80's like close to the grave. Man. Right? Six, 60, yeah. There's some, there could be some attractive 60 year old women. You've seen them, the old movie stars. Some like, of them have still got it. 70? Dude, like, what, like, I'd be so concerned that you were gonna, like, throw their hip out or something. Yeah. Like, imagine if you're, like, hitting it, and then the hip just goes. <laughs> just, <laughs> you just pulverize it in the dust. Yeah, man. You'd with your to, dick. It's pretty hectic, man. Like, he could, he could really, I mean, Kyle could, she doesn't look like she can... <laughs> <laughs> I love everything about older women. I love the smell. I love the feel. I love the mentality. The smell? Oh. I love the smell. Have you ever been in an old person's house? My <laughs> god, man. It smells like playing cards and death. It <laughs> escalated so quickly. <laughs> playing cards to death. That is a real hectic escalator. I love dentures. Women, you know, they can be self-conscious about dentures. Ladies, I promise you, telling your man that you have dentures will not turn him off. It'll put a smile on his face, it'll put a smile on his pants. Dentures? Yeah. So you dentures? I think so teeth don't get in the way during a blowjob, which I can understand sensationally, you know, feel-wise, might be a bit better, fuck, but man. you're still fucking someone with no teeth! <laughs> Dude, honestly, honestly... <laughs> Both. It's like, it might feel okay, but I don't know, so with maybe sticking your dick in Play-Doh, that might well, feel okay. I was just saying, like, I don't know what's worse, like, fucking a grandma or with without teeth or a fucking gummy shark. Like, he may as well just start fucking natural right? wildlife. Like, like, what is this guy doing, bro? Like... Not good. It's not good, man. <laughs> like... <laughs> His oldest girlfriend ever was 91. How long did that go for? Three days? <laughs> did you know that movie, like, Ghosts of Girlfriends Past? Yeah. <laughs> That's his life. With Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> I'm on my state of website right now, and there's a lady on here named Karen. She absolutely has a look that I'm attracted to. She has the platinum hair. She has a great smile. She looks very pretty, very adventurous. So I'm gonna send her an email. Another problem, right? If he gets to 80 years old, but he's still into older women, he'd have to go to a graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> Dig him up. <laughs> That's so fucked. The first time I realized I was attracted to older women, I was in sixth grade. There was a really, really sexy teacher, and she was probably about 65. She had the platinum hair, she was top heavy, and she was just gorgeous. So his type is like 65 year old obese chick with gray hair. Dude. It's a market. No one else is appealing to them. It sounded like he was actually describing like a, a rock. <laughs> <laughs> like what? what? Like a mountain? Yeah. <laughs> gray at the top, top heavy. 65 million years yeah. old. Yeah. I want to climb that shit. When I'm my age. It's not that I can't recognize that they're attractive. I mean, because they are, of course. But I mean, I guess the way I look at it is they're just, they're not ripe yet. Uh, Hi, hey. Mr. Kyle. Kyle yeah. How are you today? I'm Candace. 
My first impression of Candace, she was cute as could be. When I looked at her, I thought to myself, I bet her grandma is gorgeous. I met this lady online named Karen. I saw her pictures. I thought she was absolutely gorgeous. And I am so looking forward to meeting her tonight. Can I just say, Karen looks like a corpse. <laughs> Man, be careful what you say. I don't know when this came out. She could be a horse <laughs> yeah, by true, now. True. She could literally be in the grave. Oh, it's But fun. at least obviously she had a good night before she went. <laughs> <laughs> this is someone's grandma. Yeah. <laughs> she looks sexy as hell. The long platinum hair. I mean, I thought, wow, when I saw her. It's so great to finally meet you. You I looked know. great on Lime Dealers. <laughs> Look in this shot. It's a Look long at her hair. face. And just wait, I'll pause it. Okay. It's Look. <laughs> <laughs> Look how horny she is. She's gripping the table. <laughs> She's a. <laughs> <laughs> But dude, that just could might, might just be because she's struggling to breathe. <laughs> I mean, she's probably, she's probably <laughs> She's so horny. I clicked on you. Why did you respond? Like, how do we end up here? I look at like all of these celebrity women that are going out with younger men, and I thought, well, you know, maybe I should try it. You seem to be intelligent. Mm -hmm. He just goes, yes, I am. <laughs> you seem to be intelligent. Mm hmm. Yes, I'm the world's smartest man. I'm sorry, but this guy's got to be the dumbest fucking guy I've ever seen. You know what they say, <laughs> old pussy, massive brain. It's fun to be able to feel like this again, you know? Just all excited and quivering and no! thinking, oh, what, I wonder what's going to happen next. So you've done a lot of traveling. I've been, I've been around. Um, mm. Would you go with like someone like me? Because I'm old enough to be your mother, definitely. Maybe yeah, old enough to be your grandmother, but you're depending. Pretty, but you're pretty enough to take home, though. <laughs> Let's be able to see it. Karen looks like Senator Palpatine. <laughs> Fucking, when he merges into the hectic, <laughs> yes, he's breaking your dad's kid. Like he's already got the bags under his You're arm. Like nothing yeah. to the dark side. <laughs> but then, he, then he's finally going, yes, good, and again, good. <laughs> dark side of the falls, and again, you know, this fucking guy's full blown <laughs> senator on it. <laughs> yes, Kyle, fuck me. <laughs> and I've had such an amazing time. I just don't want it to end. My name is Jackie. I came to visit Kyle from Florida. I'm kind of hoping that he'll come back with me. Kyle and I, you know, we date on and off, but I'm really not his type because I'm too young for him. I'm just a baby. I'm only 61. Hold up. He could be either the dumbest motherfucker in the, on, in the world, or what are these women's net worths? Ah. Uh... Yeah, maybe they're is, all rich is, as is fuck. Is he just a straight up genius? Like, is yes. he just gold digging all of them? Because you know what? If you say, right, so you're in the chicks that are 80, yeah? yeah. Close to death. That's yeah. his type. So in a span <laughs> of 10 years, realistically, you can have serious relationships with 20 women that love you to death, literally. <laughs> you, you've got to sure. get at least in four or five of those wills. If you're only dating rich people, five rich wills, well, you're a millionaire. You hear of like people trying to exploit old people all the time. Like how many times do you hear of like people in old folks' homes trying to like get old ladies or old mm. men to sign away their wills on their deathbed and you hear these crazy That's stories true. like Man, I mean, at least this guy's making them come. He goes down on a 90 year old chick and then says, by the way, can you sign this? She's going to be more inclined to do it. Absolutely. That's See, that's what all you scam artists are missing out on. When an African prince emails me, <laughs> right? I'm not responding because he's never sucked my dick. <laughs> but if he went down on me, maybe, you know, I'd give him my bank details and passport so I can inherit that fortune. Oh, fuck. <laughs> we had so much fun. We really did. Yeah, we did have a good time. I've missed you. I've missed you a lot. Likewise. I mean, nobody to go to the movies with. I know, bro. He put her in the friend zone. He just called her bro. I know, bro. Oh, we, had, we had a lot of fun, bro. But he just macked her, too. This guy's alpha as fuck. <laughs> That's like the most baller move I've ever seen. He's off fucking like 17 chicks. Yeah. His main thing is okay with it, and he calls her bro. And she's like, I'm so lonely. Yeah, Not bro. only like it's and like it's one thing to call a chick bro, 
but like you've got to treat the elders with respect right? <laughs> like when have you ever heard a fucking young guy called an elderly grandma bro after he's fucked after up after he's fucked her like yeah bro yeah <laughs> Fucking cow bunga, dude. And she's got three kids that are older than him. That's crazy. What does he call them? We're best friends. We just seem to get along so well. Even when I was dating whoever and you were dating whoever, we seem to always come home to each other. I miss that. Oh, I miss it too. I miss you. Mm, bro. I think you... He did it again. He did it again. He called her bro again after kissing her. Every time he kisses her, he calls her bro. So he gives her a kiss, but then lets her know Dude. her place. You drink gay dudes who do that? <laughs> Sup, bro? I reckon he's the only person in the world that does this. Karen was 100% my type. I would definitely date her. Absolutely. But now she's dead. <laughs> well, that's the thing. I reckon, like, when she asked him that question, that would be the first thing that springs to mind, right? Like, all the girls that he was dating have died. Yeah. Or uh, incapacitated. Or... Yeah, fuck, man. That would happen so often. You're like, uh... You're like someone who adopts old animals from the pound. Like, you're just giving them a nice place until they fucking die. Except none of those people fuck the Can dogs. you imagine how different the story of the notebook would have been... <sighs> If this guy was the antagonist in that movie. <laughs> but Jackie and I, we've dated for a while. I mean, I do have feelings for her. She's a lot of fun. Should that not work out, Florida is a hotbed of sexy ass grandmas. So he's currently, so he did, oh fuck. So this is how it ends. He decides to move to Florida with his girlfriend, and then it says he's dating several older women, including Jack. No, 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 hang on. Kyle's Fucking currently living jackpot. in his son's So he is. No, so he is. He's including her. So, no, but she must just be okay in being in an open relationship, right? I guess so. I take it I her, mean, her because options she's aren't. So her options are lower, but also, at the end of the day, she knows that if she really doesn't like another girlfriend he's picked up, it's only going to go for two years before they die. <laughs> so she's like, oh, no worries, I reckon I can outlive this bitch. It's so <laughs> intense, man. But like, I don't know. I would love to look up Kyle's net worth. It's, he's probably a millionaire, He's dude. probably got heaps of money. And he probably, like, you know, has lots of property too. A, a, device, a, a diverse share portfolio. The guy would have fucking deep pockets. You know, <laughs> yeah. Congratulations, Kyle. You've done it. You've earned my respect. Continue on. Stay away from my grandma. <laughs> Thanks for joining me, mate. Where can people find you? Uh, just on uh, YouTube, Elliot Loney. Instagram, Elliot underscore Loney. And it's Elliot Loney across the board. You can't miss it. Just yep. look me up everywhere. I'm everywhere. He does some great stuff. Check Except him out. in a nursing home. I'm everywhere, but in a nursing home. I'm not Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And uh, make sure you grab tickets to my tour. No slide season. It's on sale now. Tickets are below. And so are all of Elliot's links. I'll see you very soon in the next episode of Terrible TV. Catch you later, cunt.